Well, many of our favorite coffee shops are closed right now, so you might find yourself daydreaming of your favorite cappuccino. Well, luckily, our partners at MarthaStewart.com are sharing a guide to give you the confidence to brew, froth, and flavor at-home coffee like a pro. Here's how to be your own barista. The first step is to brew a good cup of coffee. You can use an espresso machine, a French press, or just a regular coffee maker. You don't even need a high-quality stash of coffee. Just use whatever you can find. Pro tip, add a pinch of salt to the grounds before brewing. This will mask the bitterness and bring out the coffee's natural sweetness. If you want a good espresso but don't have an espresso machine, just make your brew on the stronger side with your regular coffee maker. Add in a pinch of espresso powder to your brew before turning it into your preferred drink. Now for that steamed milk. If you don't have a milk steamer or frother on hand, there's still hope. Pour some milk, ideally skim or 2%, into a jar no more than halfway full. Add a couple pinches of sugar, seal and shake the jar for 30 seconds. Remove the lid and zap it into the microwave for 30 seconds and that's it for the steamed milk. If you are craving flavored coffee, you can simply try out different syrups for your desired flavors. Or if you want to avoid added sugar, you can flavor your coffee with extracts. Stir in a teaspoon of vanilla, hazelnut, almond, peppermint or coconut into coffee grounds before brewing. And if you have a blender at home, you could whip up a frapp or is it a, is it a frappe or frappe? I don't know. Frappe. frappe. <laughs> I don't order those. Or a caffeine spiked smoothie. Plenty of options there for more uh, great tips. Make sure you go on to MarthaStewart.com.